The need for people and organizations to be viewed as thought leaders has increased dramatically, with businesses posting website content that they label as thought leadership, with more people giving speeches to be seen as thought leaders, and with more books talking about thought leadership. So why has thought leadership become so popular? What has thought leadership done for organizations that achieved such status? And how did they get there? I'm Bob Boudet. My career in thought leadership began 35 years ago as a key member of the team that brought the blockbuster management concept of business re-engineering to market in the 1990s. So it's not just about marketing. It's not just about collecting expertise at a knowledge management system. I have helped dozens of companies become better known for their expertise, consulting firms, IT services firms, software companies, and many others. My new book captures my 35 years of experience in thought leadership. It's for executives in B2B companies who believe their firm's unique expertise in solving customer problems is what sets them apart. Competing on Thought Leadership is published by Idea Press, an innovative book publisher whose authors include Ram Charan and Charlene Lee. This book is about using thought leadership as a competitive strategy not just a marketing strategy. More than 20 leading business experts have already weighed in on the book. They include Jeffrey Moore, author of the groundbreaking book, Crossing the Chasm. Ram Charan, the world-renowned CEO advisor. Charlene Lee, an expert on leadership of disruptive innovation. And Dave Ulrich, a guru on corporate culture and people management. If the idea of differentiating your company through its expertise intrigues you, then this book is for you.